Number four of my most favorite motorcycle vloggers of 2022. And this one was about the ones who I can count on to be honest and, honest and truthful about a bike or a, pro or a product review while they're doing it. Sure, there are others out there, but these are my truth tellers. You can see the link for the on my channel for the first through the third video series on my favorite motorcycle vloggers in the comments section. The purpose of these videos is to recognize the, my favorite motor vloggers of 2022. Please feel free to comment on your favorite channel in the comments section. There will be a link to the channel or channels mentioned pinned in the comments section. I would encourage you to visit these channels like and subscribe if you like them too. Meerkat. I don't know if this bothers you. It's one of the things that really irritates me is when I'm watching a review of the second year model of a motorcycle and the reviewer discloses all the things wrong with the first year bike, they're now fixed on the second year bike. But they fail to mention those things where they were doing the review on the first year bike. That's just wrong. It is my experience that, the, that these three channels will tell you what wrong, went wrong with the bike or the product when they're doing the review. They're not going to wait to the next year and sugarcoat it. They give you the honest opinion. You can agree with it or disagree with it, but they at least give you their honest opinion. I'll start with the smallest of the three channels at 66,000, just over 66,000 subscribers. It's Mr. Darcy and the Old Man. This is the father and son that do test ride, that test ride motorcycles and do product reviews, mostly from their rural Welsh farm. There's beautiful scenery, livestock very picturesque roads. They generally have a preference for cruisers and retro classic motorcycles. Although they occasionally uh, do test on uh, adventure bikes, tours, and other standards, even mini bikes. Darcy has a Harley and the old man has a BMW R18 now. They attend shows and have some provide some very straightforward comments on the bikes they see and the bikes they ride. They also do, like I said, product reviews on the things they have bought, and uh, I don't think they are generally sponsored by anybody. Because they are small and perhaps a little too honest, they sometimes don't get as, as many bikes to review as they should. You may disagree with the conclusions they reach, but you won't ever doubt their motives. The second channel I'm going to talk about here in this particular video is Motorcycle News, MCN. The MCN is not to be confused with the now defunct U.S. Uh, motorcycle Consumer News. My main person I'm referring to in MCN is the and for the interviewer that uh, and reviewer that I trust the most is named Michael Neffs. Motorcycle News has th over 309,000 subscribers on the YouTube channel. They have a Facebook page and they also have a weekly newsprint edition, which is almost unheard of now. Michael has made a series of videos called the secrets of a road tester. A whole lot of tips on road riding, both safely and quickly. When he does a product review, Mike always makes sure they're well thought out and presented in a clear and objective manner and show the consumer that the, the making sure they're aware of the trade-offs as well as the good points. If you're ever thinking about going to the track and riding on it, the how to ride on the track is a, is a must view. Michael's years of experience have put him at the top of the range as far as motor vloggers go, 
but that's why he can provide such great advice on how to improve your bike. Michael's reviews, both on short and long term, are very thorough and, and clearly point out the faults as well as the good points, and more importantly, what it would be, whether he would buy the bike or not. If you want, you can read longer versions of his reviews in the MCN newsprint. His advice is always sound and reasonable, so you need to check him out. The third channel, last but not least, on my, on my list today is Visor Down with 142,000 subscribers. The tester I watch and listen to the most on Visor Down is Toad Hancock. Toad rides the bikes everywhere and anytime. He's even ridden them up to John O'Groats in the wintertime, 1,500 miles to just give us his opinion on the bikes. Toad is a skilled track rider and can point out the changes and if they are worthwhile improvements or not and how they would relate back to the street ride. When Toad rides an off-road bike, he does an excellent job of relating the pros and cons to the average rider. He can push a street bike to the maximum, but he always relates how that would how they would be to live with day to day. Toad is at a lot of press launches and always ask a lot of hard questions and gives his opinion on whether that's a good value or not. He's a worthwhile watch for sure and frequently is months ahead of the other motor vloggers on the things to watch out for. Now my next uh, video, number five, is going to be the best group of moto vloggers I would like to hang out with. Join me and my friends at Flat Cap Cafe Racer for riding and racing. Please subscribe.